welcome back to my channel if you're seeing me for the first time my name is Joyce Anyaun yes so in today's video I'm bringing to you guys Sharon Oja yes mm. my people a lot has been going on on social media I will not sh be making too much of noise or shouting because I am outside and when you see people you know a little bit distraction just know that I am outside so just ignore that yes so what I have to say in this uh, Sharon or Ja matter is that a lot has been going on a lot of bloggers have been writing that uh, uh, Sharon or Ja is married to somebody husband according to them this mr ugo so a blogger wrote before i continue a blogger called uh, sabi radio wrote he said wonders will never end this was the same way we glad over this man when he came to marry my beautiful friend in december 2022 he was so calm and looking so handsome. We also feel my friend had found an angel. Lo and behold, the he turned tiger all of a sudden. He started conceiving with another woman. Dear Sharon, while he was busy, talking to you and building a new relationship with you he was breaking another innocent heart without cause i was really celebrating sharon until i boxed into a picture of facebook today sh showing my friend s to sharon husband and i was broke I was broke was life I was broadcasting uh, live at this wedding with my friend it quit on it's quite unfortunate no heart fe uh, no heart feeling Sharon just keep your eyes open only God know what m what man wants mm -hmm then he, sh he shed tears my friend is mourning the death of her mom and this is happening to homo hmm. iron of life ironic iron of life sharon is celebrating a man she called her best gift hmm. while my friend is mourning a man she called devil what a life may we not fall into temptation and may we not use our head to carry the consequence of what we know nothing about so guys <laughs> wahala be like pasiko this is getting out of hand well guys you have heard but before i continue this video I would like to say for those that have been coming to watch my video thank you very much if you know you have been watching and you have not yet subscribed please do me well to subscribe I will be very happy share this video always give me thumbs up thank you very much so this uh, Sabi radio I don't know it's a blogger I don't know if it's a man or a woman you know he was talking that sharon get married to somebody horse back that the the man was uh, uh have best friend husband you know so when the man came to marry he stated there he said that was 2022 when the man came to marry uh, her friend he was looking calm he was looking nice he was looking innocent her friend even thought that I have found an angel, but after marriage, the man turned to be a tiger. I, amen. 
Nothing person no go see for social media, my people. I don't even know what is wrong with people. Somebody can marry. For me, or my own opinion is that we should not judge because your first, if your first marriage is failed, it doesn't mean that your second marriage would fail. Some people will marry the first time, they will marry the second time, but the third time, the marriage will stand. It doesn't mean that because you was married before and the marriage did not work, then marrying uh, Sharon or Jah, her own marriage will not work. No. You know, nobody knows what's happened between Mr. Ogo and this uh, uh, person friend. Maybe the marriage did not work or maybe they are not compacted. You know, like we as African men, we know that we like respect. They like women to worship them. They like women to say, oh, uh, uh, this is my husband. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But some women, especially all these celebrities, them, these influencers, all these influencers and celebrities, they don't want to grieve for anybody. They don't even want to grieve for their own husband. So my own opinion is that we should pray for them. Because nobody knows, because according to what she wrote here, she did not state anything that happened. Maybe she only said the man, uh, after getting married, the man turned to be a tiger. If he was beating the, the lady, what happened, no, he did not state it yet. You know, he just said after marriage, the divorce, you know, or she, he didn't even state that the divorce, he even state that the friend was busy mourning her own mother Why the man she called love was busy marrying another woman so it did not even state that if they are divorced or they are not divorced you know that in another hand <laughs> i will not blame sharon because you know that is why sometimes because i read a story a love story that sharon made i wrote it and I, I read it and i even used it to make video that she said that they met that she met this man two months and a half you know then they got married and in that video i was saying that two months and a half is too short for a woman to know a man or for a man to know a woman that will result to marriage you know you know marriage is something that nobody wish to go into marriage after one month then you run out for me oh, i don't know of other women because marriage is a beautiful thing. Marriage can still be a beautiful thing. And marriage can still be a something that you ever regret. You know, there's a video I was watching this morning where a lady was saying that sometimes we should not allow society to push us into marriage that we will regret. Most of our African mentality, our African parents, there's a time a lady would reach and they will start telling that lady, Oh, go and get married. You are getting old. Go and get married. Look at you. Leave my home. You cannot. You don't have any opinion. You cannot say anything in that home without be reminding you that you are getting old. You should go and get married. You know, even your younger one, he will start insulting you. Go and get married. Go and command in your husband house. You know, go and take charge in your husband house. Not here. A lot of these things is our society that push women into uh, uh, running into marriage. Even though the man he don't love the man, or maybe the man don't love the woman, he will say, "Ah, let me go and marry so that I will have peace from my family, so that they will stop uh, tormenting me, so that they will stop giving me stress." Yes. So I don't really know what is the problem. And we are, I'm not praying for Sharon for her marriage to be failed. You know, the same person that I use a blogger saying, they always write things. They always write things that uh, sometimes when you go into, into families, you will find that everything is lies. But they just want to write so that they will be called bloggers. You know, so the problem is that I am saying that, what I'm saying that, if they should find out what really happened between that uh, friend and uh, that her friend uh, that his friend or her friend i don't know with uh, sharon husband which is ogo and secondly too i don't know the way they married if they are divorced because as we see in this marriage they did both traditional 
and white wedding both traditional wedding and white wedding and all of us know that if you have not divorced your previous wife or husband you cannot marry you cannot be married because you have to submit your divorce certificate before the court can join you i don't know because they did white white that in church marriage so i didn't know if they really married in court i don't really know or what happened to the first wife if they ma really marry in court or they did a white wedding so in this thing sharon have to come out and re debunk this story or mr ogo have to come out because one thing i have find out tarnish tarnishing somebody name in social media is very very bad and it's something that it can never be removed people might forget forgot about it people might not talk about it anymore when a rainbow would talk people might not talk about it anymore but something when anything triggered that thing to come back people must still go and drag it back wherever it is they will go and bring it back you know even this very Sharon marriage, people were st started comparing the marriage to David Doe marriage, you know. Even David Doe herself, his self, sorry, came out in one post and even congratulated Sharon in her marriage, her union. And he still warned that people should stop tagging her to Sharon, sorry, people should stop tagging him to Sharon marriage. People should, start, we should stop comparing his marriage to Sharon marriage you know people are always there they want to hear they want to talk they want to hear the opinion they want to talk they want to train so my people this is what I brought to if you know that it's true that Mr. Ogo which is Sharon husband married before and uh, then he break the wife had and got marriage to Sharon for me my own opinion is that Sharon husband my married before it doesn't mean that if the marriage fails, he will not marry again. The only problem that I have problem is that if he, if him has not, you know, officially divorced the wife, or then there is not good. Or if I told he abandoned the wife because of Sharon, there I will not stop. You know, you know, there's some men that always abandon their wife because of, of they have seen another girl. So if that is the case of Mr. Ogo, then I will not support. But if everything didn't go well and the woman was not, that the marriage was not, uh, was not com um, compatible, then I will say no problem. They can remarry and he can, they can go their separate way and remarry. And remarry and Mr. Ogo can remarry too. So, my people, this is what I brought to the table today. Drop your opinion in the comment section. Let's discuss. Let's interact in the comment section. And I will see you. Please subscribe, share this video, like, please. As you watch this video, give me a thumbs up. I will really, really happy. It will help my video too to grow. Thank you very much. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.